Ladies and gentlemen, it is your host there. That is right. It is Team Rai Rai. How is everyone doing on this Wednesday's edition? I am doing very well. Now, of course, I have social media accounts. But don't worry, I'll discuss that later on in this video. But first, I want you guys and gals to sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink. Or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions on the subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. It will be strictly an article. Okay, I know a lot of you out there know about this information, you know, the wrestling gurus, but I'm going to try my best to explain this. So, enjoy this video. Okay, in the recent appearance on the What the Story podcast, W World Tag Team Champion, uh, tongue tied, Fembel discuss signing a new five year contract with W earlier this year. Now, I know some of you don't like them, like boring or whatever. Hey, it's okay. You, you don't have to like everybody who walks through these doors. Baylor, sorry, Finn Baylor, I made a mistake, made his W debut in November of 2014. Sorry, I got a little tongue tied again. Sound of a gun. I'm, I'm kind of messing up. I got to think before I talk. As part of the NXT roster. Now, it's very sucks that. He had a very good match against Seth Rollins at SummerSlam, but he got injured, and then the next night on Raw, he had to forfeit that title. You know? So you could check this out. Now, in your opinion, do you think that we will ever give him the opportunity to be the main guy on Raw? Or do you think they're not going to take that kind of chance again? Let me know your honest opinion, okay? Because I think eventually the Judgment Day is just going to fade away into the sunset because all good things must come to an end. Or maybe Judgment Day will never end, okay? I think eventually uh, it's going to be Damian Priest versus Finn Balor. You know, one's going to be the heel and one's going to be the baby face. We'll see if, you know, if that's going to happen. They've been teasing it for a while. You could just tell, you know. So, I'm glad that he stick around with this company. Now, if he did not sign a five-year extension on this previous one, I guarantee he will go to another wrestling company. Like, maybe like AEW or maybe he'd do other things. <clears throat> <clears throat> but he's very important to this roster. I know a lot of you think I'm talking silly. But since Triple H took over the creating department, he's doing better things because before he was not doing not nothing at all. So, you know what I'm saying? Not very important. So he's in funny segments and, you know, very unique, you know? This past money was not PG at all. We all know that. It was It was still an epic thing. So, that's it. I love his other character. You know how he played all that makeup on. That's the gimmick. I love the character. Maybe one day, he'll come back again. So, that's just how I feel. What about that? How do you feel if that character ever returns anytime soon? Anyway, you guys can follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below for sure. Now, if you want to be part of the Robert Show, that's fine. But if not, that's okay. But if you change your mind, the link is always down below. Have a good one. I'll see you guys tonight sometime. Thanks for watching.